Hey guys, it's Dicepler Gaming here, and today there's a bit of a play of Blacklight Retribution. Now, I guess this is Captain Flag. I've got a pretty nice assault rifle. Whoa, okay, so it, as you can tell, it's. Well, can't really tell that much, I'm running around. But it's really fast paced. Not and with iron sights, kind of like most modern first person shooters. It's just, it's really nice and fast and fun. Are you saw the double kill it's right off the bat? But no, I'm not good for the rest of the video. That sucks, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, so just shooting nades. That was terrible nade. Yeah, nade. I don't know. Just in any other game except Counter Strike, I just can't find nice, responsive nades. It's really annoying. Yeah, and what? Yeah. Also, I don't. Know, I just don't like cooking nades, but. I guess it's part of most um, first person shooters. Look at all these bodies. Also, I turned my gore to medium because I kind of got a bit sick of the uh. <laughs> the, what is it? All these like chopped off heads when you get a headshot. I don't know, it just doesn't feel right to me. Having all this blood around. It's supposed to be a first person shooter. I don't think it's supposed to be some kind of gore. Just full, full of blood. That can be saved for Left 4 Dead. Now this guy, I didn't know where he was, he was like reloading and killed me from behind for SMG. So killed two people through that, uh, through that, which is pretty epic. Now these maps are pretty, well just, this one is cramped. Just, I don't know, and there's another one that I've played, what, Seaport or something, I think that's what it's called. It's just too out wide, I don't know, they should have a bit more of a mixture. They should, they should just copy our... Uh, Counter Strike the Dust 2 it has a range of uh, different distances, which is what's so nice about it. Then again, this isn't Counter Strike. What should it? What can I be complaining about? Please. Pull my hand. It looks epic. Just having those little glowing fingernails. No, I'm not a girl. Or gay. <laughs> I like nail polish kind of things. Killing spree, like a beast, high threat. <laughs> yes, yeah, so th oh, this, uh, what is it? When I go, when I do that thing where it brings up that little thing, I can't really explain it. It's just your mini map. You can't see a mini map on the screen, that's it. And because most of these we uh, levels are like multi story, it's much clear, uh, much more clear reading, much clearer reading, oh. and it's pretty much legal wall hacks. And since everyone go everyone has it, it's really, it's fair. Kind of like Uber Strike, everyone has hacks. Oh, we haven't put any gameplay because my Google Chrome 32 bin it can't handle it, which sucks quite a bit. So yeah. Oh, I just exit the game here. It's actually diff this is a clip before it actually. And here are this is the just screen featured items a bit annoying. To make the server thing bigger. So go to the equipment. You can buy equipment and weapons. Just give it all these little stats. If you see it on the right, oh, before I close it, damage 51. All these damage. You can see all these little things. These all like little muzzles. Because all is yeah. I just want to buy a silencer. Now you can't do one day purchases anymore. It absolutely sucks. I was if I uploaded it as before I had a bit of delay because my microphone wasn't working. Oh used to be good. Uh, they said they'll bring in three day weapons which we uh or pieces which will be shorter. I'm, so until that comes in, but why didn't they just all release at the same time? I don't know. 
absolutely terrible. I have to buy all these things for what, seven days. And I just don't have enough money. 2.6 is actually quite decent when you're buying one day stuff. Just terrible now. I just can't believe it. Why did they do that? Mission complete. I've, the game was, I think I was fairly, oh that's a quick match, so there's absolutely no one playing because I'm Australian. And you see here, they should just make stuff bigger. It's just annoying and the glowing envelope and all this, I don't know, they should just make it bigger. It's, no one likes a small server browser. Like when I, on TF2, even though it's already small, when you first have it, I maximise mine straight away. That's the first thing I pretty much did. This is me, yeah, just continuing the last game actually. Because I just put the Sansa, I did the Sansa in the last game, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> if you noticed it. I just cheesily spread out these clips. Uh, sorry about that. Oh, so this is Captain Flag, first time I've actually ever played it. Most is just Team for Deathmatch. That'd be a Deathmatch this morning. That stupid new updates, I'm like default weapons. This game isn't real. Isn't. Well, no one really pays for it. So I can't really talk about pay to win. And. It is free to play. It, you should check it out. It, well, after they fix it up. So after a month of this, maybe a couple of weeks actually. That was pretty nice. Now, over there, what I did was I pre fired. Pre firing is a shooting without even, real, without even knowing that the enemy's there. But since I have the wall hacked, I know that the enemy's there. So you just shoot before I even see him. People do that on Counter-Strike quite a lot, at like comp spots. So then, because it takes a while for your screen to show the your enemy, and then you making the decision, going right back to your mouse and shooting him. You just do it automatically. It's a bit quicker, and it can save you. It can save your bot. Yeah, just looking around. It's gonna camp around. I just camped around here for a bit, seeing what happened. I eventually get bored and start <laughs> running. <laughs> walking around. If you see this day, I don't get what wrong. I think that was a bug or something. Cause. You're always on the blue team. The enemy's always uh, orange. That guy looked like he was on blue. Oh, I don't know. It's just some minor glitch. Also, I have a bit more footage of us raiding tomorrow. So, can't wait till that comes up. I was going to put, put this yesterday and then my mic stuffed up. So, might as well get rid of the old things first. Now, I don't know why I didn't throw that nade. Probably because I hate nades in this game. So, I like singled it out. Tried to single him out with my uh, shotgun. It's actually pretty nice. I like the shotgun. Frag grenade. That was terrible. I don't know how he didn't notice. And how I couldn't kill him. Because you have quite a bit of time that you're where you're exposed after he throws a grenade. Ah. Uh, yeah, see, I finally reload. The D on the thing, they're just weapon tags. They also actually help. They are. They help the stats, so you can get more or less recoil. Other stuff like that. Jeez, okay. Shoot. Yeah, this is where. Yeah, I managed to kill him. Rival, rival agent. I think it means that they're the same position as you on the leaderboard. Oh, this guy just killed me. Oh, that's a flag. That's just some weird bottle of... Let's just call it nuclear blue stuff. <laughs> oh, threat eliminated. Yeah, we're on here. Also, I keep stopping because on the bottom left, oh yeah, there's also a limited amount of sprinting. And also, I feel like he's ammo way too quickly on this game. The fire rates are just, just incredibly high. 
I don't even want to use some machine gun. Like, I swear, I only have to, like, tap it and look. Well, my ammo is gone, probably. I don't know what's with these machete guys. That's just so annoying. Well, knife melee. Just annoying. Just completed the download. <laughs> Toilet. Alright, uh, now I saw that guy up there. That's what's so good about the war hacks. You can actually see where they are. Now, the re the spread or something is crazy. Oh, look at this. Come on, are you serious? That is just absolutely cheap. And you get a. Uh, absolutely cheap. Oh, not acceptable. <laughs> so bro, so bro. And those crypt crypting writing at the stop at the top right was a bit weird. Just alien. Yes. Oh that was normal nade. Yeah, there's a couple of nades. Actually I've only seen one other. But uh it's this it's really interesting. It does a blue screen of death. It's like a flashbang, I guess. Where it does like a fake blue screen of death. And then it's like loading kit. I don't know. What? I'll see. Look at that. You, yeah, you can wall bang through, which is nice. You can do some simple walling. And this game is DirectX 11, which is pretty beautiful. Pretty nice having DirectX 11. Oh, that was. Splash. Oh, that's top. Uh, I'm getting like toxicated something. Something. Just some after effects. That's what P90 stupid spray is. Look at this guy. I don't know what he's doing. And that's where we win. And I guess I'll leave you guys to this guy. Thanks so much for watching.